Howdy. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? Hope you're all doing well, staying safe and being cool. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new series that clearly won the poll that I put up on YouTube on the community tab, which was Red Dead Redemption 2. I've been itching to have a reason to play and come back to this game. It just hit six years officially like last week or two weeks ago by the time I upload this. So I'm ready to just revisit this game. Like I said, I've been having that itch for like just just this type of playthrough or play style for this game, you know? So let's kick back, relax, grab your cowboy hats <laughs> and your snacks. Let's get into it. Let's do it. And I hope y'all enjoy. Let's, what What do they say? Let, let's ride the rodeo? Pause. Let's do it, y'all. Let's go. Welcome to Red Dead Redemption 2. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Bring him in here! <clears throat> Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, 
See if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davey, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Uh, we Here we go, y'all. Okay. Oh, man. Come on. Let's go. I still can't believe it's been six years since this came out. out. Here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. I remember the first time I picked this game up. In two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. I remember the first time I picked this game up. I picked this up in Spider-Man 2018 the same day after work. Now, I didn't know which one to play first. So I was just like, I don't know what to do. Then I chose Red Dead over Spider-Man. Don't want to lose you. Can't believe we lost Davey too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay. Well, I know that, right Dutch. Now. We gotta find We're John and Michael. That's a start. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? Hello? John? Michael? How, how did he see that from Who's all the way here? back there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. Yo, my headrest is interfering with my hat. I'm gonna have to like remove my headrest after the this video. Was yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, 
Have you seen John Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Bet. You know what's crazy? This is going to be a long series. And yep. now it gives me a chance to you buy sure um, this, the PC version this for Red Dead Redemption. I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill. Huddled around a fire waiting for daddy to put food on the table. Said it before. We got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. You think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders. You know me. I'm a good boy. Right. I okay. love the way this was shot. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay. Let's head down there. Let's go. But yeah, it gives me a reason to buy Red Dead on PC since that just dropped. And I seen like probably the first 20 minutes of how the game looks on PC. It looks fantastic, y'all. So my goal is to get this uploaded as much as possible. Let's hitch up here. These parts are gonna be long, maybe like two, three. Well, maybe like two hours at most. I don't know about three. But this is a long game. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. On your left. Sounds like quite the party. Look at the graphics. You too. Get and I'm playing on PC. Sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. I could get down behind that wagon in front. They're going crazy in that house, huh? Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well. Hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Folks. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. Need some There's a body in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Now, friend. I ain't gonna do nothing just yet. I ain't asking for much. Please. I am kind of desperate. Hey. I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here. <laughs> Look at Dutch playing it cool. God damn Dutch. I was trying to use my PS5 controller, but apparently I can't. Nothing but rooting to any gun slanging. Trying to get these headshots. I don't even know where that person went. Boys, 
here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. All right, so like parts like this where I got to loot people. Whiskey. Uh, I have to uh, which one? Looks like the poor bastard was married too. At some point. I have to just like. Or drink it. Put it down. <laughs> I have to just like skim through it or cut. Oh, like do a smooth cut. You need something now. Your strength up for the ride back. A satchel. Not gonna go lie, I have my lights so bright that I'm just eyeballing the screen right now. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price on Colmo Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. I really want them to make this into a show. Like, put it on Max, please. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Okay. I think there's what seven chapters to this game or maybe six. Grab anything you think we can use and meet me out here. I think it's six chapters actually. Yeah, I think we found everything we need to. Let's go back outside. Got to give it up to Rockstar. They do know how to make some classic gems, Micah, you know. Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin. See what we need. Joe, Why would you make him search the cabin if I already went through the cabin and I didn't miss anything? <laughs> The oh, hands. He now? <laughs> Shut up, Dutch. Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here. Look at the blood Here's on my gloves. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. I want to know everything. Where's Como Driscoll? <sighs> we have the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. All right. But bring that horse when you're done. Mmm. They're the ops, yo. Where am I gonna? I should have killed them. Oh, I forgot. We gotta do this with horses, too. Relax, buddy. Relax. Not here to hurt you. Alright, boy. Yeah, I gotta remove my headrest. It's gonna bother me throughout this entire part, so after this part, let me just remove it. Is that bastard still in there? He's dealt with. Good. 
That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Tie him up over there, Arthur. Have y'all ever been horseback riding? Let me know in the comments. Let me know. Okay, we mean you no harm. Miss, please. Come on, it'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. <laughs> you okay, Miss? They came three days ago. And Father's been me. Miss, you are safe now. You can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Miss, it's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. So, uh, it's okay. Uh, get on. Uh, we'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. First, Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. <gasps> Hello, Arthur. Abigail? Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry, I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... two days. Your John will be fine. I mean... He may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And... He looked for me. Thank you. 
This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure. Well, come on then. That was my boy Javier. Not cold. There's some tracks. We got a whole poncho. This is a game where I could just get lost in for hours, but I got to remember I'm doing a whole recording and I'm not trying to record for like, what was that green thing? Y'all seen that? I'm not trying to record for like four hours. At most I'll record is probably like for two, two and a half. Cause I can't even sit there and watch a YouTube video that's four hours long. What really happened on that boat? We had the money. It seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Watch out for this crevice. Yeah, we don't want to go Dutch down there. Killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. So he just snapped. I, re I removed my headrest too, yo. I did it during the cutscene. Davy got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. I, I hit the wrong button. I was trying to do the cinematic. <laughs> Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Look how good this game looks. A lot of other games from like, I'm not even gonna say 10 years ago. We'll, we'll, we'll say from eight years ago at most. Don't even look as good as this. I think the only one that can really that really still looks good or still looks great for it to be on PC is Arkham Knight. Batman Arkham Knight. Come on, boy. Let's go, Javier. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Right, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. My dream cast for this show would be Clive Owen or Jeffrey Jeffrey D. Morgan as Dutch. Between those two. I don't know who I would cast as Arthur. If Clint Eastwood is a little bit was a little bit younger, he could have played Hosea. Or maybe Jeremy Irons can play Hosea. Let's see if he can hear us. I'm not even paying attention. Come on. Up there. Damn, his horse has been there for days. Okay. I mean, it is a storm, right? Bro, look at the clouds. It's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. Have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Come on.
Damn, bro. Look at the view. Look at my boy. The greatest video game character in history. You sure about this? It's coming from this way. Okay. It's slippery. Be careful. It's crazy. I really have this game in my top five, but like if I didn't have a top five and only had a top three, you already know this is probably number one for me. Not even probably, it is number one for me. Because of the story itself. Watch yourself. Watch out here. This is like when I used to escape high school to go to sneak out for lunch. Good old time, sliding down rocks. Okay from here. Watch your step. It's real slippery. Stay Stamina core is empty. Wall. Your movement speed will be Up limited. Gap here. That sounds closer now. Come on. Look how smooth my game looks. We're coming, John. Damn, I've been covering a lot of Rockstar games on here lately. How you doing? I'm miserable. Been a tough few days. I know. Here, take a drink of that. Yeah. Thanks. Pour me up, Arthur. I'm not designed for this snow. No. Oh, okay. He said I gotta stay sober. Come on. Okay. Can you hear me? John, you there? I'm here. Down on the left. That's John. You're coming. Down here. Hey. All right. Hot down, Marston. <laughs> Let's look at him. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> Freezing. <clears throat> Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Yes, sir. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. <laughs> See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Uh, you all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. You see that on the ridge? Oh, mm, great. Perfect. They're really trying to start. Horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. Get okay, out of here. here we go, John. Where the wolves at? Arthur. Of course. Oh, over here. Uh -huh. We're getting you out of here. Okay. Yep. Not me missing. Ah! Ooh. No. Oh my gosh. It's like the wolf from Until Dawn. At least he was nice. Let's get out of here. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. I'm racing you to the horse. Boy. Uh, 
Let's go, Javier. We gotta go. We gotta move. Got to move. Come on, then. Let's get back to the others. Yeah. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a a dog bite. <sighs> you know, fella, got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. <laughs> you ain't gonna die. Not yet. Damn, it's crazy to think. I think the first Rockstar okay. game I uploaded on the channel yeah. was GTA 4. Then we went to GTA 5. And then GTA San Andreas. I should have really played them in order, honestly, but it's, it's okay. More coming in on the left. Get the hell out of here. Oh, he's right here. I'm like, where's the other one? Let's go. See any more up there? Don't think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. <laughs> so, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. Best believe I'm gonna try my best to do See those buildings up ahead, John. damn near all the side missions. Uh, like I said, it's can. gonna be a long series, Joe. So. We're not getting this game done till December, really. <laughs> Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive! You're alive! All right, here we go. There we go. <gasps> Ay, careful, idiotas, it's his leg. Come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks, I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That's civilization. I know. The West is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> we have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. That's right, because the, it's May, he said, in the beginning of the game. We get strong, we get warm, and we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. Thank you. What's he talking about? You sound out. Just worried. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. Hmm. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit and we go back to Blackwater and we get our money or we get some more money. I love the dialogue between them. West. But we're heading east. For now. You okay in here, Molly? It might be warmer by the fire. Stay strong. I'm okay. fine, thank you. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. We got a Bill Williamson. What? What's uh? What's homeboy's name? Peterson, right? No, Pearson. 
Mr. Pearson? Something like that. I don't know. I don't remember all these characters. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. I was right. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, hmm. Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if there's game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is a rest? Come along. Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. You know what I right. realized soon? Let's head out. I think I even said it when I was playing God of War. 2018 is like one of the best years for gaming, and that's what really got me back into gaming. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Spider-Man drop. This drop. Got a war drop. It'll Detroit be becomes human dude. drop. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. All right, following you. <sighs> Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, bringing Excuse John me. back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just... A lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <laughs> well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Yeah, so like, I'm glad I get a chance to like revisit these games and do recordings to show y'all like my playthrough style, you know? And I'm playing this on Halloween, so just know this is not going up to like November, like November 8th or something. <laughs> I have no idea. There's some patches of grass here. This is good. Is it Charles? Let's try is this it? way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. No, shh. Stay quiet. Hey, stop here a second. I see something. Whoa!
Has deer been here? And recently. How can you tell? How can you not? All right, Charles. <laughs> I'm asking a simple question. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it. On your horse. A gun will scare everything around. Keep down. Move quietly and slowly. Okay. I'm just follow these tracks. You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. There we go. There we go. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Hey, I said slow and quiet, Arthur. My bad, Charles. My bad, bro. I'm just trying to hunt, I'm trying to have fun. Wait, look, there they are. Are you ready with that bow? Good shot. Yes, sir. Even though I feel bad. Should be one over here. Mm, I didn't kill it. We should go finish it off. Which one is it, though? Wait, which one was it? feel bad now, bro. You sure your hands okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Look at Charles running over there. Bambi, I'm sorry. I mean, this is how it was 1899. I don't know if I could survive during these times, so. Let's go, Charles. Come on, then. Let's head back. Back to camp. Yeah. I never had deer. I don't know if I'll ever try deer. Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? I'm just taking in the we moment. The camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go. Sitting here really he appreciating what we have right now. Good that we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. 
And that girl from the ranch now, too. But not sure she'll be eating much. She has a wild look in her eye. You would, too. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. Huh. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. Careful. Uh, what is it with the O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Nah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Combe, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. He must be real hungry. Stay well back. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. <laughs> We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. All right, so why are we still over here, Charles? Let's go. I'll rock that beer. Cut up here, off the trail. Imagine the bear just followed us to camp. It's all right, my guy. now five six months something like that but you didn't expect this what any of this black water mess being up here ah uh, sooner or later a job's gonna go wrong nature of life i just thought you might have moved on by now you want me to move on no no not at all i just i know you could run it alone no problem I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. No bad blood sure, between you. I soup. could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. <laughs> taught me to read. John, too. Tell me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Yeah, okay, boy. Epic I'll dialogue. I'm getting to learn right. more about these characters. Do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. <laughs> Won't take nobody but him. We're back with food, baby. Let's get this prepped up. I'm gonna hitch time over here. 
Want some food back, boys? Look at the yellow stains on the ground, <laughs> indicating that it's uh, pee and dirt. On. Get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. There's a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well. It's a one-star deer. What a surprise to find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. I'll get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you, you dumped on the floor there. Make sure you clean everything, Pearson. Not trying to get sick. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Still on this, like, they always said my you game looks this you. smooth. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> I got all my settings on Ultra. I forgot about that. What's Come going on in here? Boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam. And you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> well, a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cone? always had good information come on and you think now is the right time to hit a train now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit i'm getting too old for that life mr matthews mr smith mr pearson would you please look after the place there are o'driscoll's about yeah Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. The camp near some lake. Then we're rolling okay. deep. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this core they're planning. Let's go. Time to drop some bodies. Kill kill the gang members that are in our way.
Let's talk to anybody. Nope. What's that? <laughs> Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. Yeah, trying to hide from the Pinkertons with everything going on. Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest one way or another <laughs> it will be some things i can forgive others i can forget what he did to hannibal i can't do neither you killed his brother dutch yes i did and i hope <laughs> the bastards will be reunited soon enough that's how this will end see that smoke Eye uh, for an eye, right? They said it was near the lake, so I need a good thumbnail. Close. Need an epic part. Hold up here. Hey, get back on your horse. How about you shut the hell up? All right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're going to head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. I'm the leader of this group. I'm the one putting in all the work and effort. Telling me to get back on my horse. What? Keep them running down the hill. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Interesting. <laughs> I go f run. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Damn. Are they leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right. Let's go pay our old friends a visit. All right, let's go. Don't forget to grab that rifle from This your gives horse. me Christmas vibes because it's snowing. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. <laughs> sure thing. I don't want this shotgun. I'll take this and I'll take the bow and arrow. Good. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah. Just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our Not saying needs that. right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including coal, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Oh, I mean, it's about to go down. My goal is this part is going to be a little bit longer. I just want to make it out like this area of the game. I don't want to be trapped in these snowy mountains for like three parts and you know.
And it's kind of cool to for them, for Rockstar oh, at the time, to just like steep. give us a reason why he had the fallen out with Dutch. Because everything wasn't explained in the first game. It just like you were thrown into it. And he was on the hunt for like three people. Which was Bill, Javier, and um Dutch. Working for the government too. Damn, they arguing like that. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. I was about to say, I didn't change my thing from the shotgun, all right? Stay low. Come on, follow me. Okay, let's get in cover. I'm ready for this job to be done. So. What are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Of course I do. It's my playthrough. What do you expect? Okay, I'll go first. Oh. He's still alive? That bullet only grazed him. Oh yeah, this is what I like. Let's go. Gun slinging. Oh, guys, not like modern guns in other video games. We in 1899 with it right now. Come on, come on, come on. Yup, you're dead. You're dead. Oh, go. Am I getting shot? Mark to get down. What are you doing? Who is that? He could have been killed me. Jump. No, Arthur, don't get shot. There we go. Execute him. Let's go. Nice. That's a fire picture right there. I think that's all of them. Search the bodies. We can from now. Dead. Killed them all. I'm trying to get money. I'm trying to get rich. Cigar. That was fun. Heads up, boys. We got more coming in from. Oh, the do we now? Let's get back to gunslinging. My 
dead eye. Shooting from the head, from the waist. He thought he was safe. Nah, get out of here. Come on, you yep, wait, wait, wait. Yep. And that's what he gets. Let me loot real quick. So like, like I said earlier, with parts like this where I'm looting OD, I'm gonna have to just like edit most of this out. That way we don't have to sit here too long. Let me just get this last one over here. Actually over there and that's it. Y'all seen how I bodied them? I told you I take this game seriously. This is my bread and butter. Arthur, get over here. I'm right here. Shut up. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Okay. Let's go. Found him. Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. It smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you, boys. I like that mission. All of you. Got a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us as hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. Right. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know... He'll come after us. Oh, of course he will. Just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. <laughs> all right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Okay. I really enjoyed that. <laughs> Just wait till I get other pistols in this game. And a, a Lancaster repeater. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Colm? Leave him to me. All right. Hey, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay. Damn, I'm missing the, the rope for my outfit for Halloween tonight. Oh, nah. I just now realized that. I got a hard time. Now, come on.
You're coming with me. You got me mixed up with someone else. But nobody else has been up here, bud. So why this are you lying? Is, uh, very kind of you. <laughs> Damn, look how dark it got. Please, please, you don't need to do this. Now let's head to camp. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. <laughs> well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! That's funny. Hey, look at the moon. I want to put mods in this game. Don't do this, please. I think people put a Shrek mod in here, if I'm not mistaken. I'm begging you. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. All right, so we got one of his boys going back to camp. Hopefully he Please, gives us information and we got to stick up a train. Just name your price. Just let me go, please. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. okay. Not going to lie. I'm, I'm happy I chose this game because I've been had this outfit just for Halloween. So... I could really give y'all something different for recording, you know? Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boy. All that talk of God of War Ragnarok y'all wanted me to do. And none of y'all even me, voted please. for that, really. Oh, it was at like 40%. They're real nice. Y'all almost tied the pole, too. <laughs> Not a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. And feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. 
You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob! Everyone ready? All right, let's head out! Oh, snap. Whoa. Notice how Jose was trying to talk, like, some sense in him. The fact that if we keep doing what we're doing, obviously is gonna catch up to okay, us. Gentlemen, and we're already up. in the situation Call that we're in. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. Yeah, Feels man. good, doesn't it? Yeah. But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just <laughs> stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. The money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down, see how he's getting on? 
Okay. Wait, before I even do, I gotta get a good uh thumbnail. Why is my horse shitting? Alright, let me head down then. <laughs> we'll we'll figure this thumbnail out. Yep. Damn, look at the green. How you getting off? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unscrew I heard that the wire bear? and then attach it to said detonator. No oh, crap. No, this is cool. <laughs> Attention to detail, they make us do every little thing possible. I don't mind it. Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others, I got it from here. How good my game looks. Oh my gosh. And I'm still sad they didn't even win game of the year. And remember the plan. All of you, no mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Trans be here any minute now. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. Ah. Shit, no, what? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find? More. You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Uh. <laughs> I love how they all just got on each other about that. My guy. I've got you. Now stop yelling. Help! Yeah, you're okay. Now let's go slow this thing down. Where's Javier? He fell. The others will get him. No, we need to stop this train. Get my knife ready. Another guard up ahead. You want me to take him? Yes, you go. Okay. Hey! <laughs> uh, I don't think I can even sneak through here, honestly. I'm here! Bang, bang, right. you're dead. Yeah, I'm good. What the hell is Bill doing? He had long enough to set that car. Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. <laughs> you don't rob a Leviticus. Make your peace with your How are you doing that? I'm okay. All right, let's go. If we don't stop this train soon, all the boys will never catch us. Why did that scare me, Loki? I know. Just stay calm. You got him? I ain't got a clear shot. Get off me, Abe Lincoln. I 
I don't think that was supposed to happen, yo. I think that was just like bad timing. I want my hat. Nice shot. We're good, we're good. Who the hell are they? I don't know. Oh shit. Look, they're coming out of that last call. Getting shot. Watch it. Damn. Let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this. <laughs> Arthur last sounds car. tired. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Man, so let's me. get the money and go. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four, three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. I'll take that. Thank you. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Let's go. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. I still feel like being back here isn't that far enough. Yep. Train. <laughs> Ooh, Javier. Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. <laughs> oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. What's this? <sighs> What letter is this? You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, all right, dear Mr. Cornwall, we are yet to receive payment of $2,000 for the initial phase of exploration at what PT Indian Reservation. Okay. And Bruno, as agreed in the contract between Cornwall and Tar. Oh, this is his business, Cornwall and Tar, okay. It is November 9th, 1898. Hmm. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Thank you for the telegram yeah. for your continued interest useful. in the Jameson Mining Company. Give me However, any news you have received is missing. Railroad contracts, invoices, blah, blah, blah. You got anything? I would be delighted Not to really. host you in Annisburg. Sugar give you a personal from the Spanish tour. West Indies. A lot of sugar. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? Ooh, money. Yeah. Come on, let's hurry this along, boys. Not him having a painting of himself. 
Now, this looks like something. These just seem to be contracts. Arthur, have you looked down the end there? I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> ah. <laughs> What did you find? These... bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride! Great. Okay, get on the train, quick, on it! Any bright ideas, I kill all three of you. So behave. Come on, move! We won't tell a soul, I swear! Go! Said quick! Yeah, look, scared. Bro, I ain't kill you. Oh, damn, this is all the way up here. I should have taken my horse. All right, let's go. For Lord's sake, put that book away and go help. Oh, Mary Beth. So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. My bad, y'all. 
<laughs> I won a sound bar just now from work. Ball fest. A few coworkers hit me up. They were like, we heard your name. I think you won something. Somebody sent me a picture too. I'll pick that up when I go back. Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wing? Yo, Arthur sure. got jokes. I'm just saying. <laughs> say less. Pick the wheel up. There. There. there we go. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Let's go. Stay on this trail. Why couldn't the rest of them just wait? So. Yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? Hmm. How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? <laughs> we don't. Spider Dutch's talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Bruh. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. <laughs> Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. That is true. He's not wrong. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. But when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. Mm. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. John did some stuff that we, we didn't still like. Heading the right way? And that depends. Are we still heading west know? in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? <laughs> yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. 
And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. I want to know hey, what dude. happened, though. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, I like Jose's hat. Finally could go faster. Let's get to camp, y'all. Our new home. There you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Nah, you left us there stranded. You can walk. All they had to do was wait like 20 seconds. Yeah. That's it. Whatever though. Is he walking? I don't even see him back there. Not me being petty. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together, kept us alive, kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money and a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, 
We can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. couple of weeks later you know what i can't i'm trying to think i think like starting from chapter two on we got off the mountain hold on and rode east into some pretty enough country called the heartlands ain't been this far east in many a year dutch seems a little better his eyes are sparkling once more and i can see he's thinking a little clearer i think we all feel happier spot of black water and that whole mess like i was saying i think starting from I chapter think. two jose <laughs> quite a day let's hope so there's a bunch of the boys already in valentine bill charles and javier and Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> All right. Like I was saying, starting from chapter two, I think there's probably like 15 to 20 missions for each chapter. I can't remember. But it is what it is. Look at my boy. We out here. Made it to chapter two. And look at these graphics. My dear boy. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all. For the first time in weeks. Nothing. We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. All right. Move. Get out my way. I'm trying to do my out. Dutch, get out the way. I need to do my outro. All right, y'all. With that being said, I hope you enjoyed part one of Red Dead Redemption 2. Six years later, it's still crazy that how fast time flies by that this game has been released six years now you know um i'm excited so just know these these videos are gonna be like longer so maybe like two hours and 30 minutes depends on the day and how much i can get done with editing and everything like that Let's believe I'm gonna keep the cowboy hat and the cowboy outfit for each part until we finish this series or maybe until I get tired of sick and tired of wearing the outfit, but <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna plug in my socials down below. It's gonna be linked in the description as well. So you guys already know what to do. If you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button along with the notification bell. Oh, you guys are notified when I'm dropping bangers and content. Get at me on TikTok, Instagram, Twitter. I post shorts here and there. Be on the lookout for the community tab. I always ask y'all like, what days do you guys want to see the videos at what time? So I'm about to get out of here, edit this joint up. Y'all stay safe, be cool, be easy, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Howdy.